The US military has been keen on retiring Humvees for some time, and it has finally awarded the $6.7 billion contract to replace them to Wisconsin-based truck maker Oshkosh, which expects to make about 17,000 joint light tactical vehicles, JLTVs, over the course of the deal. The JLTVs, which will come in multiple two- and four-seat configurations, aren't just better armored and generally more capable trucks than the ones they're replacing, they also look extraordinarily mean. I've seen them in person, and I can attest that the meanness is real. Right parenthesis. The big selling point for the JLTV is what Oshkosh calls the Core 1080 Crew Protection System, which includes mine resistance, IED detection, and a lot of bolt armor. It's not just about defense, though, optional turret and missile launch units put bite behind the bark. A suspension that can be raised and lowered electronically makes it easier to transport JLTVs to wherever they're needed, but out in the field, it's got 20 inches of wheel travel for insane off-road capability. Oh, and Oshkosh claims it's 70% faster than the best tactical wheeled vehicle, TWV, in the market currently. The LATV is almost three times the weight of the original Humvee design. That's a major concern for the Marines, who will field the LATVs from ships initially designed to carry their lighter predecessors. In the initial contract, Oshkosh will build 17,000 of the LATV over the next few years, with 5,500 of those going to the Marine Corps. The total production run of the vehicle is set to be much larger, with the Army looking to replace over 49,000 vehicles currently in service. Western Defense Report.